Hey everyone, and welcome to today's vlog. So it's morning time, it's around 10 o'clock, and I'm headed, dare I say it, I'm headed to um, McDonald's so I can get myself some breakfast. And then I need to go to the credit union so that I can uh, pay my car note today. I'm just gonna go pay it early before I forget. And yeah, so today was like my first day posting back to my main channel. I don't know if you guys can tell, but okay, no, it, it, the, the camera, this camera fixes a lot of problems. Um, I like to drive like this. But like whenever I know that people watch it back, they're like, what is wrong with you? But like, this is how I like to drive. It's so comfortable. It looks uncomfortable, but it's not. Like I have no hands. It just feels good. Anyway, um, it was my first day posting back on my main channel, and that felt good. Every time I post a video, it makes me feel like I just took a shower. I'm not even kidding. It feels really good, so. And you see the same people. That's always nice. You know, it's just nice. I'm gonna go um, just get myself my usual big breakfast that I always get. Then I'm probably just gonna end up getting me an iced coffee. Iced coffee is what I'm gonna get me. Uh, caramel or vanilla? No, I'm probably just gonna get a caramel iced coffee this time because that one seemed to taste better than the vanilla. The vanilla one is just so miss. It's like, honestly, I have not had a hit with the vanilla, but when I tried it the other day when the girl couldn't make a latte, I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna do the, you know, um, caramel iced coffee. I, I just can't get over that. Like now, I like, I'm like, okay, you guys, like they make lattes. I've gotten several lattes from McDonald's, guys. And I've gotten it from there too, so I'm like, why can you not make a latte? That's just so crazy. To yeah, that's what's happening with that. And then I have to go ship off those boxes. I'm so glad I just looked in the viewfinder so I can remind myself so I can take that off. Um, so I can do that. I was supposed to actually return these things Friday, but I just kept forgetting. And then Saturday, I kept forgetting. Just everything was happening, so... I mean, it's just a really, once again, it's a really chill day. I'm just going to film some story times today and uh, do a review. And then I have um, two videos to edit. I'm on schedule, so, okay, uh, Monday, Wednesdays, and weekends. And then I'm posting vlogs only on my vlog channel. My YouTube life is finally coming together, so I'm really happy about that. Like, finally. I felt like my life was unorganized because my YouTube was so all over the place but I need a schedule even if I think oh my gosh I need to post this video right now I'm gonna like try to fight the feeling and try to be on schedule I don't like driving on that side of the road because it's so bumpy even though I'm not going that fast I'm still not gonna get over it because there's a hole that I keep that I've gone on over or whatever and like it almost fucked up my car so I don't even know where the hole starts but it's somewhere like up there like right up there and like no way it always fucks up my car so I just have to stop doing that anyway I wish there was some exciting stuff going on guys there really is nothing exciting and the stuff that we have been doing I can't really I mean even if I I've been vlogging it but I can't post it that's the only thing that kind of sucks where um we're doing something and it's finally coming to light so it's been a lot of it's been a lot of tedious and looking for things and getting things together and trying to find deals and blah 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 so it's always really been and i've been just doing my part as in trying to step it up you know i mean i've always stepped it up but you know in just a whole nother way and i mean i'm happy and everything it's just that things are things are happening and things are changing you know what, I can actually go to the post office over here. So I'm gonna go over here. I always drive a little bit out the way because I like the stores and the customer service in this the little town next to us. I hate where my mom lives. I absolutely hate it. So I will drive an extra five minutes for better service. Like, 
I will go to the same store in the next city over simply because I know I don't have to deal with some bullshit that day. Like, it's just, you know, anything to keep me from, like, going crazy on these idiots sometimes. Like, these people can be so fucking rude, like, everywhere where my mom lives. Like, everywhere you go, you're not going to really just find, like, nice a nice store, honestly. And a lot of the stores are small. Like, we have a Walmart, but... You know, so yeah. Yeah, so it's 68 degrees outside. Guys, it's really nice. It's not cold, but it's not hot. Would I prefer it to be 55? Yes. I like, like, I like it pretty cold. I don't like hot weather. And it's hot like eight months. Or nine months actually out of the year in Texas. It's so, and then I didn't really want to put my window down, but I put it down. Only because as soon as the wind starts blowing, it gets all in my face and it makes my face really itchy and irritated with the hair. Like, and then the hair just sticks into one place and you have to keep trying to find the hair to move and that shit just pisses me off, so. Anyway, I went on a little t tangent. It's the truth. It's weird because, okay, one of my mom's neighbors, she's a graphic designer and she does photography, so me and her were talking and she was like, oh, she would like to take pictures with me. And I was like, oh, that'd be great. I really need to update my vlog. I mean, my blog, Instagram, you know, I've, I've been saying I need to step it up. I have like a homegirl Instagram, y'all. And I keep saying that. And I do open it up like once a month. But people are fucking nosy and there's nothing to see. And just knowing that is annoying. So, and you know, so that's just, I don't accept ex-boyfriends. Like, I don't accept nothing like that. You have to keep it pushing. Simply because I know how they are. They're very, they, they, they want to come back into your life when they know that you're okay. Like, they just have that sense. And they just know. So it's like, mm, I don't think so. And then if you're not okay and they come back into your life, they don't add nothing good to it. They just add more stress. So it's like, oh, no, 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 no. For some reason, I'm not able to get into the Chase app. This application has so many problems. I don't understand. You're just an app. Why do you have so many fucking issues? Like, I have issues, like, even reaching it. It's so funny. She just came by and asked me if she was like, she was like, D she remembered me and she was like, did they tell you that they had a lot there? Thank you. Thank you. Oh. Like, I don't feel like it. I hate responsibility. <laughs> God. I should have been born a kid, like, honestly. I mean, <laughs> should have been born a kid. I should be like Peter Pan. Like, I should never have to grow up. I hate responsibility, like, so much. It's embarrassing. God. There's just so many more consequences when you become an adult, like. Speaking of adult responsibilities, a lady just told me, my tags expired and I totally forgot. They expired in September and it's almost November. I had to do a damn inspection, all that bullshit and I don't feel like it. Hopefully I even passed my inspection. I don't really know the process though. It's been so long. I think the last time I did it was last year, I think. This iced coffee. Isn't bad, but it's not that great. 